And what we gonna do to that damn devil? They so hungry. And yeah, we gonna hunt his ass down these last days, man. By Shema Mashiach man. Right? When the Lord cracked that sky and he get the true service of the Lord, that spiritual power, we gonna be hunting down these damn devils, man. Right? And we gonna be playing games and having fun in that day, man. I'm gonna be like, hey, Ephraim, man. Hey, I bet I could kill more devils than you. How much you wanna bet? I'm gonna I'm go, hey, look, I'm gonna I'm I'm get 10, I'm gonna get 10 in five minutes. Bet mansions on it. Oh, uh, hey, we gonna be having bets in that That's day, man. Right. Oh, mansions. Right. Who who can slam the the, the Edomite baby against the stones harder? We go we gonna have we gonna be having fun in that day, man. That's right. Right. <laughs> right. So hey, that, that's the service of the Lord. That's the time we waiting for, man. Right. The Lord put in our spirit to be motivated to keep these laws and commandments, man. So we can have power and rulership over our oppressors, man. Yep. So read what you got in Luke one and sixty eight. The book of Luke, chapter 1, verse 68. What? Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. Of what? Of Israel. Of everybody. Of Israel. So the most high God of the heaven and the earth is only the God of Israel, which would be you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. The Lord is not... about man if you're really sorry you're gonna get on your crusty ass knees and kiss the boots of the service of the lord that's, that's what you're gonna do man we don't give a damn about your i'm sorry man right your i'm sorry, your I'm sorry not gonna bring uh millions and millions of black hispanics and native americans back that your people slaughtered man nope. right so we don't give a damn what these damn devils come up here talking about man that's right. the lord said the wicked are estranged from the wrong they come as, as soon as they be born speak your lies man so we down here in the so-called white man run his damn mouth, man, right? Like I said, on my plantation, all these damn devils, they not gonna be able to talk no more, man. I'm gonna cut that damn tongue out, man, right? And if you wanna communicate, you gotta raise your hand, man, right? We done, we done, we done listening to these people run their damn mouth, man. Then the so-called white man say that we uh, we came from evolution and the damn, we, we, we descend from monkeys, right? Right. This man is a damn, a damn clown, man. Pretty man, give me, game. give me, uh, give me, uh, Job thirty and eight, man. Pick on that sword. Give me Job thirty and eight, man. Right. Right. We 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 not out here playing games with these damn devils, man. Right. It's the book of Job, chapter thirty, verse eight. Bring that up. Now read your piece up. It's the book. Bring that out. Bring that up. Book of Job, chapter thirty, verse eight. Bring it out. They were children of fools. What is the so-called white man? They were children of fools. Who was that damn clown? They were children of fools. Who was that damn devil? Children, children of fools. And these people are children of fools, man. Like the elders were bringing out earlier, right? These people kingdom would be nothing without our people, man. Right? They could have went to any part of the world and stole any nation of people, but they came and stole God's chosen people. Because these people know they can't survive without us, man. These people know they can't, they can't grow their own crops. They couldn't build their own kingdom. Mm -hmm. They had to get the greatest people upon the face of the earth to build their kingdom for them, man. Right? So you can't come up here and tell us a damn thing, man. Right? Speaking against our Lord, man. And we're going to pray that the Lord strike his ass down tonight, man. Yep. We're going to pray that the Lord put his wicked ass to death tonight, man. Yep. Right? Well, that's stupid. That's how God judges here. Yeah, that's how our God do it, man. Our God is a just God, man. Oh. Right? You think you're going to get away with putting millions and millions of so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans to death, and yo, I'm sorry, go change that? Nope! What the hell is wrong? These people are damn maniacs, man. These people are damn delusional, man. Right? Your damn I'm sorry not going to change, man. Right. Me cutting your damn head off, that's going to make a change, yep. man. Right? Me putting a damn chain on your neck the same way you did my people, that's what's going to make a change, man. Yep, right. Right? We don't. Children of base men. Children of what? Base men. Children of base men, right? Read on. They are viler than the earth. What is the so-called white man? They were viler than the earth. And these damn devils are viler than the earth, man. Right? Who the hell he think he over here talking to? Some simple ass Negroes? Nope. He talking about, yeah, well, I'm gonna go over here and act like I'm sorry and you know they they just gonna forgive me. Now we ain't getting down with that, man. Right? Right. Right? He talking about, well, I'm not going to get on my knees. I'm not doing that. Well, you're going you to get on your knees eventually. That's right. Right? Right. That's right. 
right. You, it was better for him to do it now, cause he gonna do it. He gonna do it later. But they, hey, when he do it later, it's gonna be way worse. Mm, right. Right. It's gonna be a lot worse, cause then you ain't gonna have no choice. I'm gonna have my damn knee on his damn neck, and he ain't gonna have no choice but to bow down. Yeah. Right. Right. Give me, give, man. Give me Jeremiah. Give me Jeremiah 16 and 16, man. And read your precept. Book of Psalm, chapter 55, verse 21. Right, bring that out. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter. Right. But war was in his heart. And that damn devil, he showed his true colors, man. Right. He came over here like the, the rest of his, all his people. Come over here talking nice and sweet. Oh, I love you guys. I feel bad. And, you know, I feel bad for what my race did. But his true colors came out. Right? That's right. You can trick these simple ass Negroes out here, but you can't trick the servants of the Lord, man. No. Right? We not getting down with that. We don't give a damn about your I'm sorry, man. Right? We want to wash our feet, our feet in the blood of the wicked, man. That's right. Right? We don't. His words were softer than oil. Right? Yet were they drawn swords. Right? That's it. That's it on that? Come. Where was you at? The book of Job. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 16, verse 16. Right, bring that out. Behold, I will send for many fishers. He will do what? Send for many fishers. Right, and we was trying to fish our people in, man. We was talking to that sister, giving her the word, and then that damn devil slivered his way over here. Right. Yeah, I, uh, he come over here trying to interrupt this, you know, the conversation we have with our sister, man. Satan don't like the true children of God getting his true words in the last days, man. Yep. Right? Any chance Satan get, he gonna come over here and try to de, try to disrupt what we got going on, man. Right? But we don't give a damn. You talking about yeah, me and my wife, we see you guys all the time, and this and that. We ain't trying to hear that BS, man. We don't give a damn about you and your wife, man. Nope. You and your wife gonna be in the cotton field working from sun up to sundown, man. Oh, right? Days a week. Right? We don't. Sun up to sun up. Come on. I was sent for many fishes. What? Said the Lord. Right, we know. And they shall fish them. And they shall do what? They shall fish them. Right, we know. And and after I will send for many hunters. Many what? Many hunters. Many what? Many, many hunters. hunters. We gonna send for many hunters in these last days, man. Right? Our God is a is a, a true and just God, man. That's right. Give me uh give me uh Luke one and sixty eight, man. Go to Luke one and sixty eight, man. Right. So in these last days, the Lord gonna send for many hunters, man. Right. So that damn devil, he gonna be hunted down these last days, man. Right? And this 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 motivate me to come out here and do what we do, man. Right. This motivate me every single day to keep God's commandments, man. To be perfect, man. Because I know in the end times the Lord gonna give us the power to rule over our enemies, man. Right? How much of a glorious day is gonna be? Like, hey, Lord willing, I get that damn devil, man. In the day of destruction, man, I want hey, I want him, man. Right? By the throat. I want the Lord to preserve him for me, man. Right? Because I hate them damn devils that always come up here speaking the smooth words. Right? I have more respect. Look, I got more respect for them devils that straight up rednecks. They come out and say, look, I hate you niggas. Right? I hate you niggas, right? I got more respect for them because I know I know for a fact he straight up. I can respect that. I hate you niggas. Well, I hate you damn devil too. What's up? But those devils that's always been sneaky, that's always been deceptive, oh, I love you guys, and, hey, man, you, you a damn clown, man. Get out of here, man. Well, I want to destroy you even more, man. Trying to pretend like you my friend, man. Because that really show, he really showing that he a damn coward, man. Right? Trying to pretend like you our friend, man. The Lou and I getting down with that, man. Nope. Right? Shoot, if he was, hey, man, he a cool to his own people. So I can't even respect that. He trying to, yeah, I'm, I'll be you guys' friends. I'm sorry for what my people did. You making your own people look bad, man. Just tell me that. Just tell me I'm a nigga and get it over with. Just tell me that you hate me and get it over with, man. Right? Stop trying to pretend like you my damn friend, man. Right? We don't. And they shall fish them. Right? And after I will send for many hunters. And they shall hunt them. And they shall do what? And they shall hunt them. And what we gonna do to that damn devil? And they shall hunt them. And we gonna hunt his ass down these last days, man. By Shema Mashiach Yahweh man. What? Right? When the Lord cracked that sky and he get the true service of the Lord, that spiritual power, we gonna be hunting down these damn devils, man. What? Right? And we gonna be playing games and having fun in that day, man. I'm gonna be like, hey, Ephraim, man. Hey, I bet I can kill more devils than you. How much you wanna bet? I'm gonna go, hey, look, I'm gonna get 10, I'm gonna get... Ten to five minutes. I'm 
bet mansions on it. Oh, uh, like, we gonna be having bets in that That's day, man. Right. Oh, you got mansions. Right. Who who can slam the the, the Eden my baby against the stone Sorry, We go we go high. We gonna be having fun in that day, man. That's right. Right. <laughs> right. So hey, that, that's the service of the Lord. That's the time we waiting for, man. Right. The Lord put in our spirit to be motivated to keep these laws and commandments, man. So we can have power and rulership over our oppressors, man. Yup. So read what you got in Luke one and sixty eight. The book of Luke chapter one verse sixty eight. Right. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. Of what? Of Israel. Of everybody. Of Israel. So the Most High God, creator of the heaven and the earth, is only the God of Israel, which would be you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. The Lord is not dealing with these weak, inferior nations, man. What? They want to come up here and act like they feel sorry for hundreds and hundreds of years of rape, robbing, murder, and genocide, man. Right? We don't. For he had visited and redeemed his people. Well, he go uh, redeem our people. His people. Right? His people, right? Redemption is only for the Israelites, man. Right? These damn devils always want to come up here and run their damn mouth, and they don't even know their own history. Yep. He, well, I didn't do that. My family came from Germany. My family came from Ireland. How the hell did your family uh, possess Ireland, possess Germany? Cause they rape, robbed, and murdered, and stole that land. The same thing, the same, the same way they do everywhere else, man. Right? We was the kings of Ireland at one point in time before them damn devils came over there. Right? He don't, even, he don't even know his own history. It's no way around it. You the damn devil, according to the Bible, is no way around it, man. We don't. Yeah, you said about this. That was yeah. Well, we don't. We don't. And has raised up and warned of salvation. For us. For what? For us. For us, right, we don't. In the house of yeah. his servant David. Right. As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets, uh -huh. which have been since the world began. Right. That we should be saved. That we should be what? That we should be saved. That we shall be saved, the so-called Black Hispanics and Native Americans, right? Right. Hey, family, if y'all if y'all so-called Black Hispanics or Native Americans, y'all Israelites. Y'all God chosen people, y'all gotta repent, keep the commandments, we know. That we should be saved right. from our enemies. What is the so-called white man? Our enemies. Who's that damn devil that came up here? Our from? enemies. Our enemies, man. Right. We want to be delivered from these people, man. Right? Because unlike these cool ass Negroes and these cool ass Latinos up here, we don't like these damn devils, man. Right. How the hell you gonna like the same man that, that rape, rob, and murder you? Put his damn knee on your neck and, and, on, and uh, choke you out on the concrete for eight minutes, man. Right? Put a damn bullet in your head on national TV, man. Right? We don't. And from the hand of all that hate us. So we want to be delivered from these people in these last days, man. Right? We're not trying to hold hand in hand with these people, man. The, our God told us that we above all nations upon the face of the earth, man. Right? Well, our people trying to be equal to these damn devils, man. Right? So we, where I had you at? We, where I had you at? All right, yeah, give me Psalm 52 and 1. And you give me uh, Psalm 140, uh, 148. Read what you got. The book of Psalm, chapter 52, verse 1. What? Why boastest thou thyself in mischief? Why do what? Why boastest thy, uh, thou thyself in mischief? Yeah, that's what that damn devil did, man. He boasting himself for his mischief. He was like, yeah, my family, yeah, we came from Germany and Ireland. Right? Not knowing that his people rape, robbed, and murdered and stole that land, man. Talking about, yeah, I'm not going to get on my knees. I seen a guy, yeah, he was on his knees and kissing the boots. I'm not doing that. Right? So you tell me that you sorry for what your people did, but you can't bow down and kiss the boot. You had to do way more than bow down and kiss your damn boot during slavery. Right? Don't you know we was, they was using us as damn uh, feet rest? They'd be like, come here, nigga. Get on the ground. And the so-called white man sit on the damn couch, drinking a damn beer, putting his damn feet up on your damn back, man. While you sitting there crouched down on the damn ground, man. That's the part of the so-called white man, man. I'm not gonna bow down to these niggas. Our people had to bow down to you during slavery, right? Right? So the Lord said he's a just God, man. So all these horrible atrocities that these damn devils did to us, the Lord said we gotta do the same thing to them, man. In the service of the Lord, we can't wait for that day, man. Read on. 
Why boastest thou thyself in mischief, what? O mighty man? Oh, what? O mighty man. Because the so-called white man, he a mighty man right now because the Lord put him in power. The Lord said the earth was given into the hand of the wicked, man. Right? So read on. The goodness of God endureth continually. Right, read on. The tongue deviseth mischiefs. Thy what? The tongue deviseth mischiefs. His tongue deviseth mischiefs, man. Coming over here acting like he our friend, man. Coming over here acting like he our damn comrade, man. Right? Acting like he our brother, man. But really he the damn devil according to the Bible, man. Right, read on. Like a sharp razor. Right, Rito. Working deceitfully. Do a what? Working deceitfully. What did that damn devil come up here and do? Working deceitfully. Right, Rito. Thou lovest evil more than good. Thou do what? Thou lovest evil more than good. Hey, look at the so-called white man's kingdom, man. All he do is love evil more than good, man. Everything that our God said is abominable and wicked, he promotes it and glorifies it. And said it's okay, right? Then our God said we can't eat pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster. But this damn devil got all these restaurants where you can get uh shrimp, you can eat a damn spider burger, right? You can eat damn whatever that, a type of abomination that you want, right? Our God said that that um you can't be a homosexual, but the so-called white man throw gay parades every damn month now, yep. right? Say it's okay for your child. To be a homosexual and choose their gender. Yup. Putting homosexual cartoons and superhero movies on TV for your kids to watch. Yup. Right? Giving your kids homosexual damn uh uh books in school. Disgusting. Right? What they call it? The damn gay BCs. Right? <laughs> Man, this damn devil, and he said, and it's the same devil that say in God we trust. America is a so-called God fair country. Right? So what God is he really talking about? What God is it that, that he that he claimed that he trusted? Him, right? He talking about this damn devil right here, man. This is the God of the so-called white man, man. This is the God that allow you to be a homosexual, man. This is the God that allow you to be a pedophile, man. This is the God that it's okay for you to be a rape, robber, and murderer, man. Right? We don't. And lying rather than to speak righteousness. And he loved to lie rather than speak righteousness, man. Like I said, I hate those damn devils like that, man. Hey, what's your ethnicity? You in a blue shirt. What's your what's your ethnicity? You a tight? Oh damn! He, do you hate do you hate black people? See, he lying, man. We, we read that again, man. Read that again. Man. Thou lovest evil more than good. And what? And lying. And what? And lying. What that damn devil just and do? Lying. These damn devils. The Lord said they as soon as they be born, speak your lies, man. They can't tell the damn truth if, it, if they like depending on it, man. Wicked ass Italians, man. He probably one of this, this, uh, the descendants that put Christ to death, man. Them damn wicked ass Italians and those wicked ass Romans, man. He said, I love black people, right? Damn liar, man. And you could tell he was lying because he had a smirk on his damn face, man. Read on, man. You're a liar. <laughs> right, read on, man. <laughs> And lying rather than to speak righteousness. Right. Selah. Thou lovest all devouring words. Right, we know. O thou deceitful tongue. O thou what? O thou deceitful tongue. And the Lord said the so-called white man has a deceitful tongue, man. Right? Like you said, he always want to claim that, that he feels sorry and that he loves us and all that. But meanwhile, he enjoying the benefits of our people, man. Right? We know. God shall likewise destroy thee forever. He gonna do what to the so-called white man? Destroy thee forever. What's coming to the so-called white man? Destroy thee forever. And as the Lord said, he gonna destroy thee forever, man. That's why the Lord said in Obadiah, he said, look, the house of Joseph gonna be in flame, right? He said the house of uh, Jacob will flame, Joseph will fire, and the house of Esau will stubble, man. Right? And there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau, man. So the Lord said he got to destroy these damn devils forever, man. Right? For all the rape, robber, murder, and atrocities that they did to our people, man. For spilling the blood of the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. Even to this very day, man. You know? He shall take thee away. He shall do what? He shall take thee away. You know? And pluck thee out of thy dwelling place. And do what? And pluck thee out of thy dwelling place. And he place. gonna pluck all the
the so-called white people out of their dwelling place, man. Because this land don't even belong to them, man. Right? These people come from the cliffs or the rocks, man. But they go around the earth and rape, rob, and murder and pretend to be everybody else, man. Right? So the Lord got to put these people out of their dwelling place, man. And what else he gonna do, you know? And root thee. And do what? And root thee. And do what? And root thee. Root. Out of the land of the living. Out of the what? Out of the land of the living. So he gonna root these damn devils out of the land of the living, man. And the service of the Lord, like I said, we can't wait for that day, man. Right? We can't wait for the day where I don't have to see another pale face, damn lying, deceitful, damn bastard walking upon the face of the earth again, man. Right? Right? It's a damn disgrace that we even have to look at these damn people, man. Right? So read what you got in, in that in song. Right? Yeah, 148. And uh, start from verse 1. The book of Psalms, chapter 148, verse 1. Right? Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord from the heavens. Praise so like you go to uh, 140. I meant 140. Go to 140 and start at verse 1. The book of Psalms, chapter 140, verse 1. Right, bring it up. Deliver me, O Lord. Do what? Deliver me, O Lord. Right, you know? From the evil man. From the what? From the evil man. What's the so-called white man? The, the evil, evil man. man. And it's a prayer that the saints, we got to pray this all the time. Deliver me, O Lord, from the evil man, man. We want to be delivered uh, deliver from this evil man, man. That continue to put damn chemtrails and pollution in our air, man. That continue to put GMO fools out and put uh, lead and damn fluoride in our drinking water, man. That continue to put guns and drugs in our communities, man. Right? That continue to shoot our people down in the streets, man. That continue to, to damn, uh, damn uh, sex traffic our women, man. Right? We want to be delivered from these evil people, man. You know? Preserve me from the violent man. From the what? From the violent man. And who is that talking about, man? Who is the most violent man upon the face of the earth, man? Like I said, when the so-called white man came over here, right, the native Indians showed them how to, how to survive, showed them how to grow their own crops, showed them how to live off the land. But what did they do in return? They stabbed those people in the back, man. Right in the back. Right? How you gonna, how you gonna kill somebody that, that, that's helping you survive, man? What type of sense do that make, man? Right? So we, we want to be delivered from these evil people, man, you know? Which imagine mischiefs in their heart. Which do what? Imagine mischiefs in and their And these people heart. imagine mischiefs in their heart, man. Right? How much you want to bet that damn devil imagine a way to overthrow us right now, man? Right? Hold your peace, hold your peace. Right? He was like, man, I hate those niggas. What did those niggas tell me? They tell me I'm going to slavery. I hate those niggas. But he just came up here and said that he loves us. He just came up here and said that he feel bad. Right? So we don't. Which imagine mischiefs in their heart right. continually. Right, we don't. Continually are they gathered together for war. For what? To gather together for war. Right, we don't. And then, hold on, the so-called white man is gathered together for war in these last days, man. What you think the, uh, the damn Proud Boys is all about, right? These people is all about killing off our people, man. Right, we don't? They have sharpened their tongues like a serpent. They have their what? Sharpened their tongues like a serpent. Right, we don't? Adder's poison is under their lips. Why we? That's a lot. Keep me, O oh Lord, from the hands of the wicked. Do what? Keep me, O oh Lord, from the hands of the wicked. Hold on, hold on. What's your, what's, what's your question? What you got? What's, what's going on? Hey, stay right there. What's your question? What's going on? Well, my question is, what is the main message? Hold on, you, you got you. Right yeah, yeah, just back up a little you're, bit. You're talking a word, mm -hmm. but you're speaking, you're speaking anger. You're speaking aggressiveness, mm -hmm. and God is love. Oh, really? Oh, God is love? Can you go into the Bible and show me what God is love? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. 1 Corinthians 13. 13 and what? 1 Corinthians 13, the whole chapter. The whole chapter? explain what God love Okay, well, we're going to go into the Bible. Hold on, don't, uh, don't let her put her. Yeah, don't, 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 don't let right. yeah, don't let that heathen put, put her hands on the scripture, man. Heathen, yeah, you a heathen, boy. Who? Uh, what? Boy. You see that? Hey, Boy. that's the damn devil, right? The devil. Hold on, we not we not boys up here. We men of the Lord. Right. You the damn devil, man. And right. You better take your crusty ass on somewhere, man. Right? Bring that out, man. Hold on. I got not. 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 I got not
lot of body love. I got no hell no, you ain't my sister, man. The, hey, the so-called black woman is my sister. The so-called Haitian woman is my sister. The so-called Puerto Rican, Dominican, and Native American woman are my sister. You got white women and damn devil according to the Bible. Hey, hey, Karen, hey, go up the street, Karen. Bye, Karen. Hey, devil, hold on, I got bye. something for you. Yeah, listen to this as you walk away, Karen. The book of Isaiah, right. chapter 14, verse 21. Bring it out. Prepare slaughter. Do what? Prepare slaughter. Hey, Karen, prepare slaughter. Wait, wait. For his children. For his what? For his children. For his what? For his children. For his what? For his children. Wait, For the iniquity. For the what? For the iniquity. Right. Of their father. Are you ready, that, Karen? Your ass going to captivity. Right. And hey, we gonna pay that you overdose off fentanyl tonight, man. Right. We gonna pay that your ass overdose on opioids tonight, man. Right. right. So take your crusty ass up the street, Karen. Right. Cause we not dealing with you, man. Bye, Felicia. Right. Our God not about love. Right. Shut up. You don't even know. You don't get up the street, man. You finished, man. Read on. Read on, man. These damn devils don't know what's going on, man. Read that, man. That they do not rise. That they do not rise. That they do not rise. And this is damn shame, man. That's why our people got to come back to the commandments. You got weak, inferior people like this ruling over us, man. That's a damn shame that we got this damn devil ruling over us, man. And your time is coming, Karen. Your time is coming. For what, you, what you dirty ass white woman did to Emmett Till, that time is coming, man. Right? Talking about my God is love. Well, it don't seem like God loves you right now. Your nope. ass on the street, you homeless, you got your dirty ass stomach out. Over here looking at damn mess, man. Right. Go up the shit. street, man. Right. We don't want to look at you, man. Right. You damn, you damn pathetic piece of trash, man. Right. right? You a damn peasant. Get out of my face, you damn peasant. Right? Read on. Right? And that's how you got to talk to these people, man. No. They said, hey, hey, what she say? She said, boys, we ain't no boys up here, man. We the men of the Lord, man. We the man that's going to put a damn chain on your neck and have your ass working in the damn cotton that's field, right. man. That's right. Right? Read on. Nor possess the land. Nor do what? Nor possess the land. It's damn pathetic. This is the so-called white man's kingdom, and she don't even possess nothing. She living on the damn streets of her own kingdom. Yep. How far have you damn fallen, man? To the ground. Right. That's a damn shame, man. Give me, man. Uh, give me, uh, give me, um, Isaiah forty-seven and one, man. Give me Isaiah forty-seven and one. Quick. Matter of fact, you give me that. I'm gonna get a couple more. I'm closing out. Give me Isaiah 47. I'm gonna cook on that sword, man. Hey, Karen, listen to this last piece of. Hey, Karen, listen to this. The book of Isaiah, right. chapter 47, verse 1. Right, bring that out. Come down. Do what? Come down. What did the Lord say to Karen? Come down. The Lord said, come down and do what? And sit in the dust. And do what? And sit in the dust. And do what? And sit in the dust. What is Karen doing? Oh, sitting in the dust. What? <laughs> oh, virgin daughter of Babylon. Oh, what? Oh, virgin daughter of Babylon. And the Lord said, come down and sit your ass in the dust, man. Right? right? Look at this damn pathetic peasant, man. Walking around uh, high off their feet and all, man. That's right? How you hey, this your kingdom and you, you poor and homeless in your own kingdom, man? That's right. Make that make sense, man. That's how you know it was never... Uh, really uh meant for these people to, to rule the world man nope. right that's a damn shame man talking about she my sister man i'll be damned if i let that damn devil be my sister man. right pathetic. the so-called white woman is a damn pathetic peon man right yeah man don't make no damn sense how the hell you in captivity in your own land that don't make no damn sense man the lord said come down and sit your ass in the dust man Right? Give me Isaiah 14 and 12, man. Give me Isaiah 14 and 12. Right? <laughs> That's a damn shame, man. Right? The so-called white man kingdom is falling before his very eyes, man. And the kingdom of the saints is rising up in these last days, man. Right? Read that. The book of Isaiah, chapter 14, verse 12. Right? How art thou fallen from heaven? How art thou what? How, how art thou fallen from heaven? Right? Oh Lucifer! Oh what? Oh Lucifer! What is the so-called white man? Oh Lucifer! With that dirty ass dog? Oh Lucifer! The Lord said, "How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer?" The Lord said, "The earth was given into the hand of the wicked." How the hell do you, are you poor in your own kingdom? How the hell are you poor in your own society, man? You had a you had over a four hundred year head start, and you still at the bottom. Tea time loser. How how damn pathetic can you be, man? Right. That don't make no damn sense. You had a 400 year plus head start 
and your ass is still at the bottom, man. Right? That don't make no sense, man. That's why these people have to be taken out of power, man. Right? Right, now give me give me uh, Hosea 14 and 1. Then I'm going to get Matthew 4 and 17. We're closing up, man. <laughs> That's pathetic, man. Right, read on. Read that. Come on, Hosea 14 and 1. The book of Hosea, chapter 14, verse 1. Right, read that. Oh, Israel. Oh, who? Oh, Israel. Oh, Israel. You so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Right? You know? Return unto the Lord thy God. That'd be homosexual. Return unto the Lord thy God. Be a part of the gay pride. Return unto the Lord thy God. Walk hand in hand with the so called white man. Return unto the Lord thy God. The Lord said in these last days, you so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans need to come back and return back to the Lord your God, man. And stop walking hand in hand with your damn oppressor. Stop being a damn homosexual and man your ass up in these last days, man. Gird up your loins, man. Gird them. Get prepared for war in these last days, man. Right, we don't. For thou hast fallen. For thou hast what? For thou hast fallen right. by thine iniquity. And our people have fallen by our iniquity, man. That's why the Lord allowed these weak, inferior nations to rule over us, man. That's a damn shame that that damn devil can 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 we can apply for the same job and she can get in a better position than me, right? That's a damn shame, man. That's the world that we live in today, man. Right? We can apply for the same job and she go get the car before you get the car. Right? That's a damn shame, man. That these people are ruling over us, man. But for some reason, our people want to be comfortable in this captivity, man. Right? That was it on that. Give me uh, Matthew 14, is, uh, 4 and 17. I'm closing up. This is the book of Matthew. Say Matthew. Chapter... Four, verse 17. What? From from that time, Jesus began so, to preach. So I can start from the top. Yahweh <laughs> From that time, Yahweh began to preach. What? And to say, repent. Do what? Repent. Do what? Repent. What? For the kingdom. For the what? For the kingdom. For the what? For the kingdom. What? Of heaven is at hand. Is that what? Is that hand? Is that what? Is that hand? Right. So like we tell you, week in and week out, right? The kingdom of heaven is at hand for you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. If you didn't know you're living in the last days, and if you want to escape the death, destruction, the famine, and the pestilence that's coming to the earth, you got to come back to the Lord, you got to repent, and you got to keep his law, statutes, and commandments, man. But with that, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah and Shalom. 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 Shalom.